hello welcome back to the quick pump channel and today I plan on doing a workout video in which I do a sort of consolidation routine because the last couple of days I've been out of the game trying to have a feeble attempt here to get back into the game so what I'm going to start doing today is start out with some trap bar deadlifts uh, go from there Let's pump it up. Wow! All right, as you can see, 135. Got 45 on each side. The, the trap bar weighs about 45. Those are the low handles. Um, so this is my first. Uh, I haven't done these in a while. Who knows? This might be my. This be my first set here. and a 35 to each side 205 and uh, get to see just how we got him all right This is whew, like burning the lungs. This is different than doing those vertical leg presses. The vertical leg presses would do it to me, but now this is doing it to me. Even more so. Alright, 255 on the bar. I want to just say. Alright, do a couple of these.
Man. Alright, that was weird. Very weak. Very weak, guys. But hopefully that will do some cause some adaptive stress growth on my weak body. I even used that for the second set. Uh, I felt like I could I felt like I could get up another couple reps, but my left hamstring felt really like it was gonna do something bad if I kept going. And I mean I didn't I, uh, something like deadlifts, even though that's like girl weight, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna risk it. Maybe next time I'll try the higher bars, but eh, I don't think so. I think I'll just continue with the lower bars and keep the high bars for when I want to try something different or when I'm doing my shrugs. Or bent over rows or All right, something. Alright, the other exercise of the consolidation routine is dips. So let's do a couple of different moves. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Find my hook. Got my little yes, that's hook. Uh, how does this go again? Oh, that's a mess of this shit. Got this. See? Carabiner. Grab a little S hook. Carabiner like that. It's not sagging too far. I got this hanging down. It's going to get a weight. Put it through a weight, and then it's going to get hooked. And then have it like that. I got it, look. I got all of it. and comfy. Usually I have like around here uh, some like pipe insulator surrounded by tape taped together so it really pads that chain but I've got a nice little lightweight belt on. Huh?
So it's around your waist, almost like all the way around. And then you have this, uh, this loop, and you put this through. And this, this chain is what's gonna hold the weight. And then come around. And that's what the carabiner's for. Ask folks just to ask folks just to secure it around the waist. Once again, look at it. So this goes around the back. One length of chain. It's like almost three feet, two and a half foot. Might have to be depending on how big you are. This is like almost three foot. And the waist chain just depends on how big your waist is. This is like a foot. This goes around, get that S hook just nice and secure so it's just not hanging like most uh, weight belts are, you know or weight supporting belt, dip belts. And then get this, put it through, make sure you have a carabiner. S hook always gets lost. <laughs> see how that always gets lost. So I keep it keep it up here. Oh you can see. I keep it on my chain that supports the that put supports the chin up bar. Pump in the chest. All right. Just a little extra on the consolidation. Uh, couldn't lead well enough alone, so. I don't know what this is.
All right, so that was consolidation, I think routine A, based on Mike Mentor's consolidation routine, and I don't know. I remember doing it way in the past and I'd get stronger, but I am so weak, so maybe I should stick to it. Uh, try to stick to it, uh, at least, till I'm able to trap bar deadlift more than 255 for three reps, come on. That's freaking insane how weak I've gotten, but, I haven't done the movement in a long time, but that's no excuse because you got people that never train deadlift. They just do strong. They're just strong in other movements. They can rip for something off the floor, no problem. So next weekend, I will uh, do the squats and the close grip pull downs. Perhaps, maybe, and like I'm not gonna like not do anything during the week but it's going to be mostly like fluff and pump exercises grabbing vitamin d i still do a pretty physical job at work so at least i'm getting a lot of core uh training with that um yeah just gonna try to watch the diet a little bit more this week try not to be as bloat lorded and uh yeah so i think we'll call that a pump all right, quit pump, keep pumping it up. Thanks, bye.